Hey yo, this is Mormon Gamer 2 here. I will be going over 1.5. Um, just to start off, I'm gonna do the start off with the sunlight center. What the, this is a crafting. Um, this is how you craft it. What these do is when it's like. Um, when you, lag, okay, okay, um, when you put this over the sun and it is activated by any redstone, like a lamp, when it's daytime, it'll light this up. Um, just, um, This turns off when it doesn't have it. So when you put it on there, since it's daytime, it will. <laughs> Whoops. Okay. Since it is daytime, it'll power it. Alright, moving on. Um, I think, by the way, this is one of my favorite things added to this. The next is the nether core, which is finally. In ore that they added to the nether. This like I kind of arranged it in like how common it is. It's it's actually pretty common. It's it's kind of like in between iron and coal, except in the nether. I um which nether quartz will be um used for many of the redstone, the new redstone, <coughs> oh. sorry, redstone stuff, um, next is the hopper, um, this is the crafting, this is actually kind of like, um, kind of like a pipe, demonstrate it right here, You can see like a can't really see it here. Hold on. It kind of connects, um, and it you need to shift to connect it though. See right there. Since that one isn't connecting, I'll just do another one. And when you put it next to it, it will transport your stuff into it. For example, you put that in there. Sorry, wrong way. Wrong way. Alright, and you put in them in there, and it slowly goes to the next one. The next one, and it should. Oh, wait. Underneath it. Underneath it. Sorry. And then it slowly fills in right there. Alright. Um, finally, they add, like, you know, pipes. Just like in, like, Ticket and stuff. And, of course, Mario. And here's a dropper. What this does um, is it's just like a dispenser. Except what it does is it drops the item like this would spawn the ocelot but hold on this would spawn the the ocelot but this drops it out as a whole item it's cool I totally forgot anyways just like It would do that for dispensers too, but just, you know, like a bucket of lava in the, in 1.3, it used to pour out, but in here, obviously, it, hold on, shoots it out like that. I don't need the fish or the lava. Um. Alright. Um. 
I would like to know what number the command block is because I have no idea. But with that, you have a lot more stuff. Alright, um. What is really cool is, um, this is new. You can make nether break, which is the item, not the block. But you can make the block by using the item. If that makes any sense. But you put nether rack into the furnace. And what it does, it cooks it, and it makes nether break, which is like a regular break, kind of shape, like this. And when you put it into a square... You know, just like regular brick, it actually makes a brick. But this will make another brick. Here, this is, um, how you make it. See, and it makes another brick. Uh, same exact thing. Okay. Moving on. Okay. Let's see what, what's next. The truck. The, this is the trap chest. What it does, it, it emits redstone, <coughs> one block of redstone, which you can add on to it with a, with a, with a redstone, um, what's it called? Totally zoned out. Um, redstone repeater. There it goes. And when you open it, it does that. And what it does, like, for you, it can ruin your day. <laughs> oh, that kind of ruined part of my... I'll just... Anyways, um, moving on. Activator rail. This is how you create it. Um, I have an example over here. What you do is you put them... Which is also... This is also a new... Item TNT on a minecart. What it does is I can power it, and when it hits the activator rail, it activates the TNT, which is pretty much in the name, and it blows up. It's a kind of new little addition to the game. Um, next is the redstone comparator. This I don't really understand this, so, um, if you want to know more, I would, I would, uh, find someone else, because I have no idea how to do it. Um, next, I have the weighted pressure plate. What, this is how you craft it. Um, just two gold ingots and two iron ingots to make the weighted pressure plate. It isn't like a regular pressure plate, though. You don't step on it, and it, like, you know, emits redstone. It, what you do is you add blocks, and the more you add to it, the more redstone it does. See, look, just, like, a little more or, like, equally half of the stack gives it strong enough gives it enough to get that far except that one's the light one it even has it in the name see so look light oh, light um anyways the iron is heavy so <laughs> you need quite a bit What you do it was like you just need a bunch of it, and that's a whole step. Ah, oh, come on, don't go into my inventory. Okay, what this does is it does a whole stack. It only does two, so you need like a lot for that one. See so one more with another stack, and another. And another. Wait. This, sh I think, yeah, that's off of it. Alright, this, and then it should light it up. Oh, come on. But, yeah, anyway.